Hello students, in this video we'll see how to use Taylor series to approximate certain functions. Let's approximate the square root of 10 using Taylor series. What we can recall is we've already done one type of approximation for this in Calc 1. The linear approximation says that f of x is approximately f of a plus f prime of a times x minus a. This is the linear approximation formula. This is also the first order Taylor formula first order Taylor polynomial. So if we add more terms to this series, we'll get a higher order approximation. Now what we'll do here is we'll take f of x to be the square root of x, or x to the 1 half power, which tells us that f prime of x will be 1 half x to the negative 1 half power. In the point A we'll choose here, we'll choose a equals 3, or 9 rather, because we want the square root of 9 to be 3. So if a is 9, that's what we'll use. And so note that f of a is f of 9, and the square root of 9 is equal to 3. And we choose a number to center the Taylor series at so that the approximation is easy to do. And so that tells us that f of 10, which is the square root of 10, is approximately, the first order approximation, f of 9 plus f prime of 9 times my x, which is 10, and my a, which is 9. So now we can fill in these things. So what would f prime of a be? So f prime of a will be 1 half 9 to the negative 1 half power. And so that will be a 1 third. So this is going to be a 1 over 6. So then I'll have a 3 plus 1 over 6. And then we'll have a times 1. So it looks like roots 10 will be about 3 plus 1 over 6, which is going to be 19 over 6 if we simplify. So that's the first order linear approximation. Now we can go deeper into the Taylor series. So recall what the Taylor series will tell us. The Taylor series says that f of x is f of a plus f prime of a x minus a. There's my linear approximation part. Then we'll have an f double prime of a over 2 factorial x minus a squared plus f triple prime of a over 3 factorial x minus a cubed plus and so on so on so on. Where the general term is the nth derivative at a over n factorial x minus a plus dot, dot, dot. So what we'll do is to use our approximation, we can choose to go as deep as we want in the Taylor series. So for this example, what we'll do is we'll just use the quadratic approximation. So the first three terms in the Taylor series, these first three terms over here, are the quadratic approximation. And the remaining terms are the error in your approximation. So let's compute the second derivative. So the second derivative, f double prime, of x, we'll have a 1 half times negative 1 half, that's a negative 1 quarter, and then we'll have x to the negative 3 halves. And so if we plug in 9 to this, we'll have f double prime of 9, we negative 1 quarter, and then 9 to the negative 3 halves. And of course 9 to the 1 half is 3, and 3 to the third power is 27, so we have a 1 over 27, so this is going to be negative 1 over 4 times 1 over 27. Okay, and so what we'll see over here is we'll see that the square root of 10, which is f of 10, is approximately f of 9 plus f prime of 9 times 10 minus 9 plus f double prime of 9 over 2 factorial. 
and then 10 minus 9 squared, and then plus an error term. And this error term are simply just all these terms that have powers above 2. And so now we can simplify what these things are over here. So we'll have 1 over 108 divided by 2 over here. So this will be equal to, so f of 10 would approximately be 3. We found this over here was 1 sixth times 1. And then we're going to have a minus, well, 4 times 27 is 108. So we're going to have a minus 1 over 108 divided by 2. And then we're going to have a times 1 squared. And so this is going to be 3 plus 1 sixth, and then minus 1 over 216. And if we simplify this expression, we'll find our, we'll get our approximation for the square root of 10. We could have gone three terms deep. What will happen now is that when you plug in 9 to these expressions, you'll get higher and higher order fractions. And so you can get as accurate of a simple, as accurate an approximation as you want by going deeper and deeper and deeper to the Taylor series. Thank you very much.